Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be talking about investing and investing goals. Why am I investing and what is my investment goal? Following on from the previous video, I had every intention to open up a Moneybox account and review my thoughts on the app as I registered. However, I found myself getting nervous and before you knew it, I was Googling, does investments affect my taxes? Whilst opening the account, I realised there was a lot of questions, mainly about taxes. I decided to pause the registration for now and research further into investment and all the terminologies and rules behind it. Whilst doing so, I stumbled across the Money Advice Service. They have lots of detailed posts, all things finance, but today I have focused on investing and more specifically, the beginner's guide. One of the first things to address is why am I investing? This was a question I realised I hadn't answered, I hadn't thought of, and I wasn't quite sure how to answer. I knew it was something I should be doing, however, I hadn't been clear about my reasons why. From a personal level, I would like to invest because I want to secure my financial future. I would like to know there is additional income and a possibility to increase my wealth. However, thinking more deeply about this, I want to secure my son's future. Over on Insta, I've been talking about student loans and the payments I have to make each month, of which a high percentage is interest. If I can help it, I really don't want my son to be making these payments for 30 years. So my goal is to try and pay this for him. Now that is a huge amount of money that I've got to try and raise up. Probably 30k plus. It'll be even more by then. So let's get really clear. My savings goal is to save enough money to retire early. However, my initial goal is to save my son's university fees. This goal will take many years to achieve. However, I would like to focus on saving for my son's fees, which currently they are just over £9,000 a year. Let's call it 9000 which means over the course of three years, there'll be 27000 Obviously, there'll be a change as there will be inflation, change of practice. However, this gives me a good goal to work towards. So that's my goal, to create investments of roughly £27,000. The next stage to learn more about the types of investments, which type of investment do I want to choose? Do I want to go down the stocks and shares avenue, a property avenue? That's probably not possible, but um, which type of investment do I want to choose? Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll speak to you soon. Bye.